choosing the best dental insurance for a business can be difficult. There's so much to consider, and there's no easy way to make an apples-to-apples -apples comparison between the many different plans, networks, and reimbursement options. But Delta Dental is here to help you understand the value of a strong network with a simple, straightforward way of paying benefits that all comes together to give you and your employees more choice, convenience, and savings. Our business clients have the option of including one or both of our dental networks in their selected dental insurance plan. Our premier network includes 94% of dentists in Arkansas, with an average savings of 21% on covered services. Our PPO network includes a smaller number of Arkansas dentists, 48%, but delivers a larger savings of around 26%. Here's a quick example of Delta Dental's network discounts in action. Your employee, Lisa, has learned that she has to get a crown. Let's assume Lisa has already met her dental plan deductible for the year. By seeing a Delta Dental Premier Network dentist, she'll have a larger number of dentists to choose from, and she'll save money on what she has to pay for the crown. If she chooses to see a Delta Dental PPO Network dentist, she'll save more money, but she may also have to drive a little further to see her dentist. It's a simple, straightforward way for Lisa to know how much her Delta Dental plan pays for her crown and how much she pays. And whichever network Lisa's plan offers, she's guaranteed that her dentist will not bill her for the difference between their fee and what Delta Dental has set as the maximum allowed amount for that service. But some dental insurance companies pay benefits based on more complicated calculations. One of these is called Maximum Allowable Charge, or MAC. Under a MAC benefit payment, the dentist submits their fee. Then the insurance company bases their and Lisa's coinsurance amounts using the same allowed amount for in-network claims. However, in a MAC approach, the dentist can bill the patient for their coinsurance amount, plus the difference between the submitted fee and the maximum amount allowed by the plan. This results in a much higher cost to your employee compared to what she pays out of pocket under a Delta Dental plan. The same is true for another, even more complicated calculation used to pay benefits. This one is known as Usual, Customary, and Reasonable, or UCR. Benefits under a plan using UCR are determined by the insurance company, looking at how much dentists in an area charge for a certain procedure, such as Lisa's crown. The insurance company then pays benefits in terms of a percentile. For instance, if a plan pays up to the 90th percentile, that means 90% of dentists in that area charge the same fee, or a little less. This method typically drives up the coinsurance payment for employees, plus allows dentists to charge the difference between the submitted fee and the maximum amount allowed by the plan. Looking at the sample benefit payments, it's easy to see the significant savings Delta Dental offers through its networks compared to other insurance companies. The other benefit payment practices we explored, MAC and UCR, typically offer a lower premium, but you need to understand that with those lower premiums comes much higher dental care bills for employees, leading to greater dissatisfaction with both the benefits and the employer. Delta Dental has been providing dental benefits to Arkansas businesses since 1983. Our strong relationships with dentists across Arkansas means you and your employees have more choices, more convenience, and more ways to save on dental care. And when employees are satisfied with their benefits, they're more satisfied with their job, which means a happier and more productive workforce for your business. If you'd like to discuss the various dental plans we have available for businesses, give us a ring or shoot us an email. At Delta Dental, we're proud to be the champions of your smile.